Hello friends and welcome back to the channel if you are new here my name is Chris aka okay, the IT guy and in today's video I'm going to show you how to make a Mac OS Bixar bootable USB drive by using the simple steps that I'm gonna show you and before we start we have to know the prerequisite to make uh, the bootable USB drive the first prerequisite is to have the image file and in this case I have my uh, Bixar image here if you don't have the image you can check the first link in the description on where you can get it and if you want to be my patreon to get it right away you can go ahead and join from one dollar a month and you can get this image as quick as possible and the second thing that we will need is the usb drive in this case as the image is quite heavy i'm using the 16 gigabytes of flash disk and you can go up there's no problem but it is prohibited to go beyond uh, below 16 gigabytes because it can cause problems and the other thing that we will need, we will need now the command, the command you are going to look it on the web very quick. Um, I'm going to type Mac OS bootable USB drive like that one and the first link that will come from the search result. There will be a, a lot of instructions on how to make different bootable medias and I'm going to navigate to where it is written Vixer to, to copy the command that is appropriate and we'll continue with the other processes and as we are seeing here here is now the command I'm going to go ahead and copy this and minimize the browser because we don't need it in this time and I'm going to open my disk utility to erase the disk to make it ready to do the works so I'm going to type disk utility in the search and choose this and we see there will be a list of the volumes that are mounted on our system and the volume that we're going to erase is this that is called disk which is now the flash disk that I'm going to erase and I click on erase and after you click on erase it will bring up this pop-up here is the way you put the name of the device so I'm going to put it to call this USB for no reason you can call it the name that you want as long as you remember the name so go ahead and click on erase and it doesn't take a long as I'm saying right now now it's about to be finished and let's wait for a bit and here we go go ahead and click on done and close all this and the next step that we are going to do is now to copy this image file to to the applications and to do that i'm going to go on go and on applications like this and i'm going to drag and drop this install macros big Sur in here and there it go and after we do all of that i'm going to go ahead and open the terminal and i'm going to type terminal like this one terminal i forgot the error terminal like this and once you are in the terminal let me zoom for a bit to show you guys what's going in here and once you are in the terminal you can go ahead and paste the command that we use to copy on the web and when you take a closer look there will be where it's written my volume and you have to change that name to the name that we gave the usb which is now the usb like this one and the, this name corresponds to this and once you are in here you can go ahead and press enter to start the uh, processes and it will ask you for the password i'm going to put mine and remember to put yours too and press enter and in this case it will ask you if you want to erase the volume named usb and I'm going to, to press Y which means yes and you hit return and in this case you would erase the disk and to change it to the specific name as install macros big star and to uh, begin the copy process to the disk and we have to wait uh, for this process to be done but for the sake of making this video short I'm going to leave this and will come when they are complete
Alright, and once all these processes are complete, you can see that it was able to write from 0% up to 100% and it was able to make the disk bootable and you can find the bootable media at this address and you can be able to boot from this drive. Let me know if this video helped you a lot if, and if you liked it, show it by pressing the thumbs up. If you're coming on the channel for, for the first time, make sure you subscribe. Let me know in the comment if you met with any problem and I will always be here to help you. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Peace.